Leo. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I hope you guys are all doing well. So this is going to be your mid-month love reading. July 15th to the 30th, 2019 for Leo Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. I am using the Beautiful Creatures Tarot deck for you guys. I'll also be pulling you a Romance Angels card. And also, I'm sure some of you have probably seen me use these before. Oracle of the, sh of the Shape Shifters, but they go so perfect with this deck. Really, it's such a great combination, especially for this type of reading, which is going to be different from your love reading. It's going to be the same as we did the mid-months the last two times. They're, you know, questions spread. So if you follow me on Facebook Live, you know that the, the card's got to pop for me for a, a reading like this. So the first question is, what is the energy between the two of you? Sorry, I thought I was going to sneeze. I guess I'm not. Okay, sorry. I've been like sneezing all day. What is the energy between Sagittarius and their person? What is the energy? Leo, Leo. I don't know why I just called you guys Sagittarius. Leo, July 15th to the 30th for Leo. Leo. This is the energy between Leo. Does Leo want from the relationship? What does Leo want? Okay. What do they want? What do they want within the relationship? Leo's partner, boyfriend. Okay, so the energy between the two of you, Leo, is the Nine of Wands. So you're going to continue to push forward. Like neither neither one of you is backing down. You're going to fight for the relationship. I do feel like with this card in this deck... That you're also healing too, or you know, being spiritually. Guided. This, this, uh, kind of resembles Jesus for me. What you want from the relationship? You have the Queen of Cups. Now you might want a Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. 
But you want someone who is loving, caring, supportive. If you're male or female, it doesn't you know, necessarily have to represent your partner. It's, you know, representing the energy, the emotions, and what it is that you both want. You know, you might be lacking support from this person. Like, you may need them to speak honestly from the heart. What they want from the relationship is the Six of Swords. You know, so they want the relationship this is a transition. It's also moving from shitty times to much more calmer, peaceful times. They want peace and harmony. You want, you know, empathy, love, support. And I do feel like you're both looking for some kind of security, stability within the relationship, emotional happiness. And you do have two sixes here, which could represent six days, six weeks. You know, the sixth of the month the 15th of the month. What you need within the relationship. Yeah, you know, you have the Two of Cups and the Six of Cups. I mean, this is definitely a soulmate connection here between the two of you, for sure. I love it. They do... Rep, rep, um, relationship uh, on on this particular card. You know, you you definitely it's connecting more on a deeper level, spending more time. You know, together, deepening the bond between the two of you. You guys need time together. You need a stronger, a deeper connection, more love. what they need from the relationship. It's just beautiful how you both have the soulmate energy going on. I definitely see reunions. You both definitely want you want you you both de definitely want this relationship. There is a lot of emotion here. You're you're both looking for more love. You're both looking to connect on a, more on a deeper level, on a, on a more emotional level. It really is beautiful. You see them as the Nine of Swords, which is. This is a card of worry, fear, anxiety, sleepless nights. But, you know, I think you you see this person as someone who's very anxious. You know, worried, having a hard time sleeping, needing more balance. And they see you as their partner. They... Unity at the bottom of this card. So, again, you know, they see you as someone that they can have a strong, stable foundation with. You know, they, you know, they, they see you as marriage material. They might, they might even see you as wanting to move in together. They definitely see you as a partner, a soulmate. They see you as their soulmate. 
absolutely really really nice let me get you an oracle card what a beautiful reading leo really and if they were afraid before they're they're just not anymore they're fighting for it or you are i just love how you have both soulmates it, it, it just that blows my mind and it is an emotional time. We're in cancer season, so things are emotional. But you you two will definitely, definitely figure it out. Okay, well, that card went flying. Where did it go? Oh, wow. There's actually two here. And oh, my God. Some of you are getting engaged. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Yeah, I would say so. Definitely. And romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. Yes, they are. All right, this is the front of the shapeshifters. Singles, you absolutely could meet your soulmate in this time period. Six days. Some of you might even be getting married soon. It really is beautiful. That's the case. Congratulations. You guys really are absolutely soulmates. If there were challenges, you guys are so getting past it. I don't feel like it's six, it's six weeks. I just don't. I'm going to be very honest. I do feel like this is much sooner for you guys. The fairy bee, your life is sweet. Well, I would have to say, look at all the green in this card. There's a lot of growth, stability, security within this. And it symbolizes abundance. And those of you that really are wanting to get into a new relationship, find that soulmate relationship, love is definitely in the air with this card. What a great card. Oh my God, and that's another six. I can't even make this shit up. You guys have three sixes here. This is six days. I think that's spirit telling me that I'm right. I literally just said that. Wow. Six of swords, six of cups, and this is the number six card. You know, for some of you, the bumblebee might even be a, a good luck charm for you in some way. If you're single, if you could meet this person in a park. Or you that, you know, you, you did meet the, this person already in a park. What, just a great reading. I have nothing else to say. It's absolutely amazing. Leave your comments. Let me know how it turns out for you because it's just really, I mean, you've got soulmate energy all over the place here. It, and that, this is definitely telling me what I just told you guys before, that this is your life partner and eventually you will get en engaged, married. If you follow me on Facebook, I'll see you guys tomorrow, Monday. I'll see you Wednesday. Those of you that do not, I will see you guys back here for what? Oh, you're um, bi-weekly. You're two weeks. Two-week reading. Absolutely love you guys. Love your reading. Take care. Bye.